Hello and welcome to the hit news sports game, uh, sports ball, Lucio Ball! Again, the first round match. Oh, look at them! Look at that handsome, look at that handsome man right there. You, see, mm, I'll touch him a little bit just on the face there. Estadio Dust. I don't want to pronounce that wrong. Oh, got on the goalie. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on. I am absolutely the biggest uh, football fan in the entire world. I am way into sports. I watch every sport whenever it comes on, and as you can tell, I'm very athletic by the fact that I'm moving back and forth. And this is how I run in real life, because I run all the time. Get the f get out of here. Get out of here. Don't bring that into my house. I'll kick you in the grundle. Ooh, you see that? You see that? Oh, yeah, I saw that. You see that deflect? Bring it here. I tell you what, last night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was a save. Tell you what, last night I was over here goalie ging, and and I and I and I boost I, I I boomped that ball, it it bounced straight across the field and into their goal, and I've never been prouder of anything in my entire life. It was kind of like that, except way cooler. Man, it's a, every 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 year, it's a family custom, for all of us to gather around the TV when the Summer Olympics come on, wearing our finest pair of leather pants, putting on our cowboy hats. And using them as a nacho dipping uh, sauce bowl, and like like we use like the rim of the cowboy hat. I didn't know if I make that clear enough, but we put we melt cheese in the rims of the cowboy hats. We dip our nachos in them, and they're delicious. And we have a wholesome family time, gather around the fireplace watching the Summer Olympics, because that's that's just how it goes. It's a very fond memory I have of watching sports all the time. And the Summer Olympics are my favorite part of every year because there's Olympics every year. That's how it works. It's kind of hard to chitter chat when I'm so focused. I'm so in the game. Come on, give it to me. Give it to me, papa. Actually, don't give it to me because that'll, that'll mean that it's close to our goal. Yeah! Yeah! Sport! Gotta stare, at, stare that guy down. Let him know that I mean business and I'll get that first. God. What, what, what good did that do us? I'm not one to be cynical. I do apologize, but he kind of just pulled it towards him for no reason. Look at that! You set me up for that! You set me up for that score in your own goal! Watch this, watch this. He set that up. He pulled it towards him, bounced him off the wall, came towards me. Bada bing, bada brick. Heck you, boys! I don't give a shit! Who's ready to go fast? Uh, yeah. I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this. Ride that wall. Yeah! I often forget how the radius of the blast isn't as large as I think it is. Come on, come on, come on. You're emote, 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 emote. You need to taunt them. Sorry, get out of here. Get out of here with that garbage. Who was... Who... There was... Who was supposed... Okay, somebody was supposed to be goalieing on that goal. And I... There is no one. There was no one there. And I really hope that if we play that back, I wasn't on the goalie position because my face will be red. 30 seconds. Ah, we got this in the freaking bag. Especially if I do this and it doesn't do anything. That's great. Just wasted my ult. Who cares? You bumped that in. You bumped that in. Oh my goodness gracious. And now we're tied. Oh god. Okay, there we go. That's more like it. Lucio Ball! Put myself up, I don't care. Is this what it feels like to watch sports? People get this heated about sports, right? People get excited. People get into it. Pe people get all revved up. People rev up their fryers about sports. That was a good meme on my part, if I say so myself. Go, boys. Another game, another game, another game, another game. I need that skin. I need that skin. I don't even care if it's the white and red one or if it's the blue and yellow one. I want one of his Olympic skins, please God. I purchased probably like $25 worth of crates now and I just really really wanted in my life for Christ's sake I got 
Genji's Japan flag skin twice. It was cool the first time, even though I barely play as him. But second time, it's just like, you could have used that slot in the randomly generated assortment of items for a Lucio skin, and you let me down. You let me down, Nintendo. You didn't give me the Lucio skin I so desired. Bump it in, bump it in. Son of a ass. Come on, come on, come on. Good goalie in, good goalie in. Come on, guys. Good hustle, good hustle. Brought orange slices and Capri Suns for all your soccer asses. This ain't Little League. This ain't Little League, boys. This is the real deal. This is the real NBA. We got it. We got it. Just gotta bump it in. Just bump it in. No, just bump it. I'll bump you. This is reminding me of when I used to... All sarcasm aside, when I actually used to play sports. Because for whatever reason, I'm pretty sure like every small child in America has had a weird sports phase. Oh my god, did you see that? Oh. But I'm pretty sure every kid in America has had a weird sports phase where they just play a bunch of tiny sports for some reason. Which I mean, you know, isn't necessarily a bad thing. It's a good way to be active as a child. But I used to play, um, I, di I did play a little bit of soccer, but... Um, the story I'm thinking of is when I used to play floor hockey, which if you don't know is just like indoor hockey and you use uh, Roller blades No, 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 not not blades or skates. I, I don't even remember if we use roller blades or roller skates We might have just used like slidey shoes I don't remember but I played uh, indoor hockey floor hockey when I was a child and um, before the game when we were Standing there across from each other and like it was kind of like a not a stare down when We were getting ready for the match to start and we were standing Like inches away from each other with the puck in between us. I would uh, take my hockey stick and put it between uh, Whoever was across from me the enemy the enemy's ankles and and thrash it back and forth <laughs> like I would I would put it in between their ankles and just go like clack, 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 and just like clack it as hard as I can back and forth between their ankles in, in pure spite and as much as I tried to teach good sportsmanship and um, Fairness in child sports. I, I never bought into that um, In my mind they were the enemy. They were the bad guys Therefore I was obligated and even maybe possibly um, required to hate them because they were the enemy. They were on the opposite side of me. They were the bad guys. I had to hate them. And I had to hurt them. And and I kept doing that. And then the uh, coach guy had to pull me aside and be like, Hey, don't do that, please. If I remember correctly, I think the coach was like... He was like one of those uh, kid sports coaches that gets way too into it. You know? Kind of like how I'm getting way too into Lucio Ball right now. Ooh, ooh, did you see that save by our goalie? Yeah, yeah, we did that. Oh, yeah. Oh, there I am. There I am. What did I do? What did I do? Wait, did I score? Did I get a goal? I did? Oh, yeah, I remember that. <laughs> then I got an emote because I'm, I'm a little douche. Let's have another go at it, why don't we? Bada bing. This is what it all comes down to. Third game, last game. Come on, let's go. Chop, chop, people. Uh, live up. To, uh, do your training. Get the strong legs. Man, I tell you what. Soccer players, I haven't seen very many in my life. But I have seen their calves in hot diggity damn, if I say so myself. Like, that that's some solid leg. <laughs> I did get a handball once. I don't know why I remember there me getting a handball in child soccer, because it was probably a relatively regular occurrence, right? Because I mean, kids don't know what they're doing. Kids are dumb for the most part. But I think I was goalie, and I grabbed the ball, even though they always made it very, very clear: do not grab the ball under any circumstances. But I just caught it, and they're like, and he was like, a tweet on his little whistle, and I was like, what? And then he was like, a handball. That's the end of that story. I think a kid might have kicked me in the junk with his cleats once. It's a vague memory. I don't remember if I was just, if it was a dream or if I imagined it. It's one of those memories. For whatever reason, I remember the memory being green tinted. So maybe I was on the uh, <laughs> Mary Jane Wana when I was a small child. A uh, very fuzzy memory. Who knows really. But yeah, I could have swore I was just sitting there with my legs open and then some kid, he might have offered to kick me in the wiener. 
like with like with like the bottom of his cleat. I don't remember. Maybe he just did it. But you know, who even knows if it actually happened? Because I'm sure if it happened, my mother would have remembered. Because I probably would have cried, and she would have been like, "What's wrong?" And I was like, "That kid stomped my dick." Soccer boy. Soccer boy. Soccer boy. That's me. I'm the soccer. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whenever I like jump like that and I see it go under me, I feel like if it made it into the goal while going under me, it would be all my fault, and I would be ashamed. Did you? You just need to score it in her own goal. Watch this. Watch this. See that? See that right there? Oh wait, no. Never mind. Oh no. Yeah, that was him. That was the. That was our own guy. Well, that's great. We we can still make it back. We can still make it back. We just need two points in 45 seconds. No big deal. <laughs> no big deal. And I have my ult ready, and I can't do anything about it because I'm goalieing, and it pulls it towards me, and that would be a bad idea. We do have to pick it up, but I have to hang back here, so sorry I can't help you guys out. There was another time um, when uh, I used to play softball. I um, I would intentionally beanball them all the time whenever I was pitching. Every single time I was on I was on the mound, I would just I would take a softball and chuck it towards their face and knock a bunch of kids out cold. Um, I thought it was really cute and charming, but um, they had to call like a billion ambulances. Um, and I had to pay for all the medical bills, the bills, all the medical bills out of my own pocket as like a six-year-old child. So that's when my life really started going downhill. But it was really funny, so, you know, it was all worth it. That's uh, all 100% true. Haha, <laughs> not really, guys. I'm, I'm yanking your chain. <laughs> yeah, see that? That was totally a save. They didn't say save, but it totally was. And it was the best save I've ever done in my entire life. Actually, no, the best save I've ever done in my entire life was aforementioned a goal when I was goalie. And I got it in from all the way across the field. And everyone threw me on their shoulders and uh, dumped me in a bucket of Gatorade and left me over there overnight. Because that's how you truly celebrate a victory, you know. They say that you're, uh, that you're supposed to dump the Gatorade over them or whatever. But real winners get left in a bucket overnight and that's that's just how the the cookie dangles i guess i'll just chill here and look at that i'm going to retreat into the hole hey nice job nice angle nice trajectory nice uh bumping you did a good job ha Oh! Right off the bat. Right off the bat. Not even five seconds into that. Look at that. You see? Bada bing. Bada boom. Got that push advantage. Pushed it in there. I'm the winner. I'm going to do it again. I'm going to do it again. Just you wait. Just you wait. Ready? Speed up. Speed up. Boom. boom. See that? I did it. I did it again. <laughs> Bada bing. We did it, boys. I'm going to take a swing of this. Liquor. Oh, it tastes a lot like Dr. Pepper with no alcohol. Oh, let's see what I did. Let's see what I did. Was it a goal? Did I get a goal? Oh, yeah, I did. I forgot the most impressive goal of all time. Bada bing. Thank you for joining me on Lucy. Yep, voting myself up. I don't care. Thank you for joining me on Lucy Ball. Join us next time when it's not. Lucio Ball, and it will be um, Reinhardt Baseball, which actually sounds like a really fun time. You know, he would charge him between the bases and hit the ball with his hammer and all that. Sports.